How's it going, everyone? And welcome back to the Sleepy Hearth. You'll notice these things on the screen. Well, if you've ever noticed that sometimes my videos don't show up in your inbox, see that little bell next to where it says subscribed, where you should be? You'll click that, and you'll get notifications whenever I upload a video. And if you don't want to do that, then at least check back every other day. You'll probably see something. Other than that, if you do want to support me financially, patreon.com slash sleepyearth. Go ahead and uh, throw two bucks my way. I'll make it worth your while. Twitter.com slash sleepyearth. If you just feel like following me. And I also love my videos there too. So, let's get into it today. Ignore what the side of the screen tells you. So I am going to be playing the Shrek deck. That's right. Jade Golems coming at you. It's one that I built, so we know it's going to be pretty bad. And I think I've played this deck once before, but it's been a long time since I've done anything with it. So, don't know if it's going to be any good. I suppose we'll find out. Alright, so we're going to keep the Jade Claws and check everything else. That's pretty much the way I see it. I guess that's just what we're going to have to do with. Not a great deal. But we'll make do. Go ahead and lure that down. I think for now we'll just save the claws. No need to go in on them. Ooh, that sweet mortal coil bait. But he's bracing, them, bracing himself because he knows it's coming. Here's another one. One. If he's got another mortal coil, it'd be kind of interesting. But not too surprising. I like how it shows me where the coin is in his hand. It's kind of funny, to be honest. It's like, well, I know it's... Oh, hey. Doomsayer already. I guess he really just doesn't want me to do anything the next turn. It's not a huge deal to me, man. Um... Tell you what, we'll do that. And then we'll do that. So I guess he doesn't really have anything else. It's probably good for me. So what I could do. I could wait till turn six, play out Jade Spirit, and then use Brewmaster. Next turn, depending on what he puts out, I can use out my Spellbreaker. Or Hex if needed. I'm guessing he doesn't have a whole lot. Yep, we're both biding our time at this point. Face of Shambler. Go ahead and put out one of these. See what he's got for that. Who knows? Mountain Giant. That's fair. I won't get to keep it though. That's tough. That is tough. Alright, so right away, we're gonna hex that. I think. Oh, I don't have a coin. Hmm. Oh, I could have just used Devolve, but nah. Giving him a 7 cost would be a bad idea. So I think we'll wait till next turn to see what we got. Brian's kind of scary though, who knows what he's got in the store. He might have a uh, Kazakus coming up. But whatever he's got, I might throw a Devolve at it, to be honest. <sighs> really? Oh man. Oh, there you go. Got some, got some value out of that. Okay. So 
Let's go ahead and do this. And then we'll return him to the hand. And from there, we'll take a few off of him and go right for the face. That's pretty much the plan. And if you don't like it, then it's too bad, because that's what I did. Emperor Thousand. Yeah, that's a scary thought. I'm going to get rid of him. I was actually willing to trade. I'm surprised that it make me make the trades, to be honest. Oh well. I think what we'll do. No, not facial shambler. That's not what I meant. We'll do our elemental. And then we'll do that. There we go. I forget if I'm running Bran. Yeah, I am. I got Bran in the stack. Took me a minute to remember that. Shadow Bolt. That's no fun. How are you going to use your Emperor to get rid of it? Are you going to use another removal card? Two for one combo? I mean, if you do, I'm just going to kill you with my 1-1. One, one. Really? He's going to make me make the trade. See, he's learning. He can get that damage on me. Problem is, I can still get some value. He's going to learn. Aw. That's unfortunate. All right. I see. That's fine. Oh, I love funnel cakes. Some more claws. No, 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 hold on, hold on. There we go. Now we can get rid of that. Now we're gonna go in. Let's get some more fellas out here. There we go. Much better. Now we're starting to make the big time plays here. Let's see what he's got for me next turn. I do love that I have the golden jade spirits. Well, that's no fun. This guy's really just making it not fun for me. Probably gonna pick a ten mana. No idea what he's gonna do. So I should definitely be prepared. Ooh. That's probably the best bet, to be honest. However. Okay, yeah, I'll we'll just go with that. Let's go. There it is. Come on, Tillon. Almost. Looking pretty good so far. Next turn. I can even throw my face a shambler, or I can just do a defender. Ah, look at you. Oh. Well, that's no fun. What man are you considered? Yep. That is no fun. Oh, I always got this out. There we go. Got a little bit of defense on my side here. Don't know if it's going to be enough to get me by. 
He still has his big potion. It might just be do a ton of damage. I think eight damage is the most he can do with uh, Kazaka's potion. Oh, yes. Oh, that's not good. Yep, that certainly hurts. Okay. Hmm. I think the idea... Heal myself. Go with that. And then... See what this gets us. I can't tell if that's bad. I can't tell if that's actually going to do me worse. Just because, uh... Grim Patron. I suppose we'll find out. It's a pretty decent matchup. Ooh. Oh no. Darn, that's good. That is a really good, uh... Combo there. Is he gonna take it? He's not. Nice. Could have had that for cheaper, I guess. Speaking of which. Alright, let's go ahead and get rid of you. And we'll go from there. Now, if I top deck a Moat Lurker next turn, we'll really be in business. Hmm, I'm kind of surprised. Does he have enough? Does he have face damage? Nope. But he has that. <laughs> I could. That'd be kind of funny, to be honest. What do I have left? Not much. There's not a lot I can do with that. So, you know what? Let's just go. <laughs> He's probably got lethal. Close enough. Does he keep his armor? Nope. He foregoes the armor too. Huh. You know what? I am fine with losing to Draxus. That is that is okay in my book. Alright. Let's go ahead and play another one. That was actually a pretty fun matchup. Deck did uh, a bit better than I thought it would, to be honest. Not that it performed perfectly, but it did what I more or less expected in that situation. So, let's see. Who? We're looking now. Tempting. We're gonna keep Lover Baron. We're actually gonna toss everything else. Actually, no, I'll keep Devolve. In case he puts out an early combo that I don't like. J Lightning's good. I love that card. No, oh, that's one of those kind of priests. It's not even a real dragon priest. Okay. I can do with that. I think Blubber Baron's kind of cool in theory. 
It kind of reminds me of that one paladin card, Bolvar Four Dragon. It might just take too long to build up, even if you get it right from the get go, or you'd have to have a lot of early game low drop battle cries to make it worth it. Of which I'm clearly not getting them right now. Come on, man. There you go. It's usually not a whole lot you're going to do on the first turn. Alright, give me your two damage. I can take it. It's going to be just fine. There we go. Man, oh man. It's not letting me have a good time at all. Alright. See what he gets out of this. Good old thoughts do. Alright man, taking way too long for my taste. Don't even know what kind of deck I'm playing yet. <sighs> man, why am I the one yawning? It's supposed to be making you guys yawn. Spellbreaker. <laughs> I could. That'd be kind of funny, to be honest. Oh, tell you what. I'm not going to coin out anything. I'm just going to keep to the status quo here. Probably put a Lotus Agent next turn. Depending on what he does, of course. J Claws, there it is. Let's go. In the end, it's kind of kind of hurt him though, because he's got overload. Hmm, it's not a bad choice either. Could he kill it? Is the question. Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. I do want to take advantage of that bat or uh, yeah, that battle card value on all accounts. Hmm. He's really going for it. It's not all surprising. Suppose I would too. Alright. Hmm. Funny thing is I could youthful brewmaster him. That'd be really funny. But I will not do that. Instead I could shade lightning him. Um, yeah, I'll just do this instead. Ooh. I kind of like that. Yeah, let's go with that. Yeah, no, I don't have a weapon, so we're just going to do that. Okay, so we got that out of the way. Got no one manas. I like how it has a little uh, lotus counter up here. I don't know if that's for me or if that's for him. Ooh, that's a good call. Glad I held on to that jade lightning. So we're gonna go ahead and use it. He has to have three minions for that. 
Alright. Um, yeah, let's just do that. Yeah, now I got my own counter down here. Okay. That makes sense now. Perfect. I'm really glad I saved that Jade Lightning. Now there is some uh, Primo Silence Bait. If I ever saw someone. And again, hmm. tough call. Face a shambler. Hmm. Or are these gonna do that? To keep him from getting too many cards. And do that. See what he does from there. Gotta watch it, otherwise I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna lose the cards. <laughs> I still can't believe I didn't use the coin for anything. I mean, I didn't really need it this time around. Nothing called for a coin. But situation may still arise. Who knows, maybe I'll get a 6 mana card I want to play with a 5 mana card. That would be a situation I would need the coin for sure, so we're not going to waste it until, until we have lethal. And then we'll just flip him a coin and be like, here you go, as we win. Now remember, we haven't really seen... Oh man. I don't like that. Really? He just cleared his taunt for me. He's clearing his field. I'm not gonna say thanks. Just because I'm a little nervous. It's gonna make that round cheaper, but we can get him. If anything, I can copy him. I wonder. Let's find out. Okay, so it doesn't work like that. That's fine. Well, we still have an Emperor, which is very useful to me. And hopefully, we'll get to keep our brand. He, he could either control it, or he could kill it, depending on what cards he might have. So, definitely not out of the woods. That one's definitely to be expected. Hmm. <laughs> oh, is he gonna combo that? All right, things are getting kind of scary here. The thing we're gonna do is he considered a six. He is. Oh, that's scary. Hmm. I might get him something really good if I devolve him. Um. Tell you what, we're just gonna take a chance. Oh no! I gave him better cards. Welp. Okay. Uh, mark of nature, for sure. Assassinate would be pretty good. Mm. Wrath would be better. Go ahead and get rid of him. And then... I'll attack with him. We won't return that. That works. Uh, 
It's probably going to kill the brim. But that's kind of fine. I don't really mind. That was actually a little unexpected. Unless he's got other plans for it. Alright. There's your drink. That's fine with me. It's my Baron up to 5-5. Five, five. Okay. About freaking time. Hey. Thanks for the follow there. Okay. I guess they're making the the big time plays here. So I think what we do So we're at two two, so we're at nothing really crazy. But we can make a five five. Oh, here we go. Perfect. This actually works. See, it's a good thing I saved that coin. There we go. Perfect. Let's see how he gets through that. Still thinking it's a priest. Priests have a uh, one of the most frustrating tool sets. So things could still be pretty dangerous. I wonder if putting a Blubber Baron with Bran would uh, go crazy. I don't know. I don't know, because it's not a battle cry. So it wouldn't work. His would. So we get a 2 2 and a 3 3. And they would both get taunt. Okay, so he's clearing up his own field. I'm okay with this. Do I lunar visions? Hmm, that's a tough call. Um. No, I think we J-Claws into J-Chieftain, to be honest. I think that's the play. There we go. Get rid of that. Get rid of his... What's this one again? Ooh. That could get dangerous. But I also want to get rid of this freaking Northshire. Alright. I was going to use Full Brewmaster on the Chieftain. But the problem is, is uh, I don't have any space left on the field. But I definitely feel like this was the proper way to go. I didn't realize that the J Claws technically was a battle cry and that would proc off of Bran, so that works for me. Plenty of taunt on the field's always good. Huh. <laughs> That's one way to do that. Did he seriously boost up his North Star Click? Why wouldn't he boost up his Dragonkin? Seven seven, which is always good. I also want to say we got the combo. Okay. So I think first things first. Oh no. <laughs> I didn't attack with him first. Oh well. Mistakes were made. Many mistakes were made. There we are. I'm gonna kill you. Kill you. And then we 
we'll throw in another J Chieftain. There we go. Technically good, I got an extra 5 damage in there, but I totally effed up. Got way too excited. Be like, yeah, let's make it happen. And that was my ultimate demise. Oh, he finally got rid of Bran. Took him long enough. Got to so much value. Because Zacchaeus could be, uh, could be a bad news bears, though. Did he even choose? What? Alright, how much damage do we got? I think that's actually game, isn't it? Yeah, it is. I think that's what kind of what he saw. Is he saw that I had lethal. Oh man, some good times. Great oldies. Didn't expect a... Uh, didn't expect that one to go the distance. Sweet, we got the golden hex. Definitely have to throw that in there at some point. All right, for those of you watching on Twitch right now, because I know we got, finally got some, uh, stick around. As for everyone else, I guess this technic yeah, this next part technically goes for everyone as well. If you wish to financially support me, patreoncom slash earth go area. Just chuck two dollars promise to make it worth your while twitter.com slash sleepyhearth if you want to see when my videos go up or if you just want to see me retweet random things check that out as well other than that thank you guys very much for watching and i'll see you on the next one